YouTubers um, doing this video for a, a contest on YouTube by Dolly VH and um, this is my 180 gallon uh, South American cichlid tank and over here I have my 100 gallon um, African cichlid tank um, how I got into this hobby was uh, probably about 12 years ago it's about 13 and um bought my first fish tank uh, for like $60, didn't know what the hell I was doing, goldfish, cichlid, mix together, bad combination, and then starting to get into these guys, these has always been my favorite right here, these Africans, um, let me turn this off, uh, by far, um, definitely my show tank, uh, everybody tend to love these guys, uh, it's a lot of them, um, they all get along. They've been in here for for years, for right two years, I believe. And then um, over here, this is my newfound love right here, um, South American Central American Cichlid. Uh, there's a lot of vijas in there, a couple of peacock bass, a couple of dat noise. It's a little bit of everything. It's a grow out tank. Um, I have another tank in my garage right now. It's a 200 gallon. It's not set up yet. I haven't built a stand. Um, that's where the, these guys will go to next, or I'll split them up. <clears throat> and then, um, then my salt, my filter. This is uh, a 75 gallon filter. I uh, made this myself about um, a couple months ago, about I guess eight months ago or something. This is uh, nothing but Ponto's plant. Um, I've, I've built my own um, filter socks, it's way better. My old filter socks will last me about uh, two days. Um, I use crushed corals and um, I got Jampari to stir everything up, keep it clean down here. I got two Placos, um, Adonis Placos. Um, I have a couple of filter media, some mesh, some um, carbon, bile balls. All the way up to this, uh, it, it rates for 2200 gallons an hour. Um, I slowed it down a little with this, uh, by changing it with a lock on it so I can determine how much flow goes through. And it flows right at about uh, 1200 to 1500 gallons right now. Um, this is my love right here, um, these tanks. Uh, I spent a lot of time on them, uh, and as you can tell, they're right next to a window on both sides, so I can just stick a hose out and do a water change really quick. Um, they eat nothing but extreme, um, new life spectrum, and uh, cichlid gold. That's these guys. Um, they, I've had them, I've had most of these guys for about, I guess, four or five months now. And they're growing really quick. They're getting huge. And, um, one little shovel-nosed catfish right there. I know, he can't stay in here for long. <clears throat> and then over to my African tank. Um, they eat nothing but NLS pellets. Um, I want them to stay on the healthy diet so they don't get bloat and die and all this other crazy stuff. There's, I don't know, about 50 to 60 of them in here. This is a 100 gallon long. Um, they've been in here for a long time. They've done fine. I know a lot of people say I overstock it, but I love it like this. They've done great. There, there's aggression, but not much and not long there's even a chocolate cichlid in here somewhere um he didn't do well in the other tank so he's in this tank um yeah i can't find them there's too many around and then i have a couple of convicts they always make babies it's crazy it's good feeders for all the other fish there's my chocolate right there <clears throat> Yep, but that concludes my uh, video of all three of my tanks right now set up. And uh, thanks for watching. Um, good luck to me in this contest.